Hello everyone, in today's video I am going to show you how to do these super simple nude glitter nails. They're really easy and really effective. These are actually for a bridesmaid. Um, so I'm starting out, obviously I prepped the nails, added the base coat, and I'm doing three coats of this pink, nudie pink. Then I decided it was a bit too pink, a bit too warm. I don't know. It just wasn't the right nude that I wanted. So I actually went in with another colour on top. But here's the second coat of pink. These are really lovely nude nails. They're really sophisticated and professional looking. Great for like a job interview if you don't quite know what sort of nail wear is allowed. Here's the third coat of pink. Obviously you can use whatever nude you like, but don't forget that you can layer colours to make different colours if you don't feel like actually mixing them. So now I'm going in with a more, um, I guess the other one was a pinky nude, this is more of a tan nude. This is Gelish Bashful and I'll link all the polishes that I've used down below. And I did two coats of bashful, but again, obviously just use a nude that you like. Now, we were just going to do the glitter fade on the ring and thumb nail, so that's why I'm starting with the ring finger here. But basically just plonk on some uh, glitter. We chose like a, um, it's like a coppery gold. It's not a gold, it's not a copper, it's sort of in between. A nice nude glitter. Just plop it onto the nail and then blend it down. I clean off my brush after I've plopped the mo uh, most of the glitter on and then fade it down the nail. Then you're going to need to do two coats of top coat just to make sure it's nice and smooth. And that is basically the finished design. Like I said, super simple, super easy. So many different applications for this um, technique. You know, you could do it on a colored nail. You'll see, I think, in my next nail video that I also did a similar effect going the opposite way. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one.